Hi, this is Bill with Dine Drink Vegas. It is January of 2023 and I'm here in the Aria outside the Proper Eats Food Hall. The Proper Eats Food Hall is kind of a food court area which took the place where the buffet used to be. And what I want to do is take you on a quick tour to show you what they have. The first thing, and this is outside the food hall proper, but they've got a donut store that looks amazing. In particular, I would love to try a fruity pebble donut. You also have a coffee stand, which is great because the line at the Starbucks in this hotel gets really busy sometimes. There's several entrances in here, but there you can see the main entrance. Let's go take a quick walk through. Now, one of the things you need to know when you come here is when you decide what you want to eat, you can walk right up to the counter, but you can't go to the counter to actually order your food. What they have is a series of kiosks scattered all around like that one right there. And I certainly don't want to get up and involved in their business, but you can sign in there. You can order from multiple places at once if you have one person who's buying lunch for lots of folks. Alternatively, it becomes real, real easy to split your check that way by having each person just order their own thing. And while this isn't cheap in the sense of mall food courts, it's a good deal less expensive than most of the other nice options in Vegas. Here is Egghead. It is an egg sandwich place where as you can see most of the sandwiches cost nine or 10 bucks, which is a pretty good deal for breakfast. You have a deli. Now, when you order from the kiosk, what you'll do is you'll put in your cell phone number, they will text you when it's time to come and pick it up. You're welcome to walk around and look at them preparing all of the food while you do it. This is Shalom, y'all, where you can see them grilling some meat. I saw them grilling some cauliflower earlier, and they've got kebabs there. I think that's probably the next place I want to try, but that's a hard call because there are so many really good things here. Let's go take a look at Soulbird. Again, making dishes fresh right in front of you. What I wound up getting for my lunch today was a piece of pizza, and that was some of the best pizza I've had in a very long time. Um, there was an actual flavor to the sauce. There was the right amount of cheese. Also, it was a cheap lunch. I had one slice, which was plenty. That slice was $7 with two meats on it. It would have been 5 bucks if it had just been cheese. What I had was this Hero Quest, which I highly recommend. You can see they warm it up in the oven back there. And that's where you pick up. Let's go back around this way. So a burger joint, Lola's Burgers. I apologize. Um, where I've been watching grill at burgers, they smash them fresh. Then you've got the Laughing Buddha Ramen. So I've not tried this place. I can't speak to it. But I love ramen in particular in Vegas because a lot of times if I partied too much the night before, if I partied too much the night before, um, a bowl of pork and salt sounds really, really good the next day. And the ramen is a good choice. Here's a look at their menu. Actually, let me go back to the burger menu, which is actually a great deal as lunch in Vegas goes. So if you order a drink, you'll get your cup from one of the bars. However, you can see over there, the station, and that's the only station I've been able to find, where you actually go and fill up your cup. Let's go take a look at it so you can see what sorts of drinks they have in the dispensing machine. <laughs> Much like a food court, you've got you know, your straws and ketchup and all that here. You have Coca-Cola vending machines with a pretty wide range of choices. You also have a sushi bar where it's been packed the whole half hour I've been here with them making sushi right in front of you. You also, because it's Vegas and they wouldn't do it any other way, have a proper bar. Bar. Let's go take a look and see what they have. I hope you've also gotten a sense of how big this place is. The seating's full right now because it's a consumer electronics show, but even now it's possible to get in and get a table. And the bar has a good selection, a lot of people standing up there. So I hope this video has been helpful to you. What we try to do at Dine Drink Vegas is get, bring you short, focused videos so you've got the information you need to make decisions about your next trip to Vegas and to plan it out. If we have been helpful, I hope you'll support the channel by clicking like and subscribe. 
We would also love to hear from you. We'd love to hear from our viewers. So leave a comment in the comments section below. Tell us where you like to eat or ask us any questions you have about the Proper Eats Food Hall. Thanks so much and happy travels.